hello everyone and welcome to the rpg esports gauntlet number 34 this is a recording i am your host randomize and we're going to be recording some of these games and putting them up on youtube for all of you to enjoy with that our first game is going to be disconnect blue versus utsa jv disconnect blue in the blue and utsa in the orange this is the first round so this is the first round first game of the gauntlet and things are already kicking off for both teams chivo though not the best touch he wanted there oh a prime opportunity for a goal to happen but a miss flip not allowing disconnect blue to get the goal to get the lead here so that's a very dangerous pass across the net a lot of sloppiness coming out of both teams right in front of their net almost a good goal right there a good block as well Ravella taken out and the first goal is going to go in and it's sub sub spider that puts that one in for some reason my audio just decided to cut out there too which is very interesting chivo was ready for it but could not get the momentum he needed to get over and save that one so disconnect blue is going to take the lead here in game number one but it's already in favor of utsa vela looking for the flip reset no but he didn't have the boost to get himself closer a really nice attempt there train it's going to keep the pressure on this blue side a good center but a double commit and train accidentally tapping the ball in the wrong direction but puts it into the corner on the orange side a lot of confusion coming out of utsa right now a lot of panicking i can almost say ravella doing a good job clearing the ball off to the corner passing it to center but train couldn't get there in time chivo looking for the boost and that ended up leaving an open net the Django is going to put that one in and we got a two goal lead for disconnect blue a lot of mistakes coming out of utsa right ideas implemented at the wrong time players going off for boost when he wasn't guaranteed to be in the hands of the team so hopefully these guys are going to be able to re, uh, kind of reconnect with each other instead of uh, how blue team disconnect is being disconnected and working just fine but a shot on net stop spider doing a good job saving that one sean able to knock this over into the utsa side it's a backboard pass train clearing that but spider is there sean doing a nice job putting that on the side i'm sorry if i'm butchering that name by the way to django with a 50 50 <gasps> chivo not the touch he wanted but he was able to recover from it sean putting this into the center train clearing this out spider is there ready for it Going to keep the pressure onto the UTSA sign. The Django trying to center this one. But his teammate backed up. Spider doing a good job keeping this ball at the 50. Still putting a lot of pressure in midfield. The Django up to Spider. Spider looking for the shot. It's a backboard pass. The Django couldn't get up. Sean also went up. That's a double commit. Chivo going to clear this one out. To Ravella. A good play there. Open net. And Ravella is going to put in the first goal for UTSA JV. A beautiful counter attack. Two players went up for a shot where they shouldn't have probably. Allowing a good pass play to Ravella. And Ravella is going to put that one in. So UTSA with a one goal deficit here in game number one. Plenty of time for them to come back with two minutes and 10 seconds left on the clock. Chivo tried to slow this down, but Ravella got in his way. Some confusion coming out of the UTSA side still. Ravella trying to do some fancy work off the wall. Sean missing that train. Tried to continue with it, but couldn't. The Django tries to get as much pressure as possible. Sean right to the net. Ravella is there, saving it. And a pinch play out of the two orange players, but cleared back over to the UTSA side. Sean trying to center this one up. Not the best touch in the world. Train was going to put this back in the corner, trying to clear this out, but the Django. Getting on top of that, Ravella is going to turn the ball to the other side now. Shot to net, but an easy save for Chiv Chivo. Ravella, without the boost he needed, cannot go up. So he had to stay back. 
The Django looking for the shot. Chain jumping a little early, but still gets the save. Chivo. Oh, no. Bouncing off his teammate. He's still up there. And a save coming from Ravella using the top of the net to get there as quick as possible. But still a lot of pressure coming out of this disconnected team. Sean already in the back prepared for any big clears. Big center. Django to Sean. Sean looking to put this through the backboard. It's bouncing off. Oh, but Spider getting a weird early flip, not looking for what he wanted. Django looking to keep the pressure, keeping this at the midfield. He's going to bounce this off the wall for a teammate. He got there, but Train was able to get the 50. Spider looking to center this one up for Django. Django hitting the crossbar. Sean with the follow up. All three players on disconnect are up now. Retreating as fast as they can. Ravella looking to center this up, but no one was there. So Django making a big clear. Spider wants to put that one down, but Train getting in the way. Ball back heading towards disconnected blue. A good pass to Django off the backboard. Spider is up. Gets an angle. Misses the shot, but Sean is there to follow it up. That's a three to one lead for disconnect blue. 18 seconds left on the clock. I do not think new TSA is going to be able to recover to this one. Great play coming out of disconnected blue. UTSA having a lot of difficulties working together as a team. But since they're dash JV, I'm guessing this is the 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 JV team, if I should say. Oh, pinching in the center of the right where the net could be open. Chivo just dancing around, not really sure what he's doing. Sean without any boost. Tried to get a little fancy, but we're going to put this ball on the ground right there. And that's going to be disconnect taking game number one. Here at the RBG Esports Gauntlet number 34. Great play coming out of Disconnect. A lot of passing plays coming out of them. Big clears. Really nicely done. UTSA had their moment. That one goal, the big breakaway, was exactly what they needed. But they're going to need to do more of that and work together if they want to try and take a series off of Disconnect Blue. But with the performance that they were just showing there, I, I I don't see this quite happening. This can get a little scary for the two of them. We're going to be moving on into game number two here. Disconnect Blue in the lead of the series, one to zero. Kick off, staying pretty neutral. Spider is going to respond to it. Up high, double commit, added disconnect. They have one player back there. Let's see if UTSA can take advantage of that. No, Spider gets up in time. He gets a good touch. Train trying to slow this down. Gets pinched, though, and the ball's high over the net of UTSA. A lot of pressure coming out of the counterattack already. Django doing a great job getting the save over the shoulder. Spider, though, not touching the ball he wanted. Ravella is going to put the first goal in for UTSA. A lot of confusion coming out of the disconnect side. Stub. Stub Spider, not getting the touch he wanted. A double commit. Oh, the double commit actually is what gave Ravella that goal. One player a little too low, and the ball's bouncing all over the place. So UTSA now in the lead, 30 seconds into this game. There's going to be a little bit of nice cushion for them to feel comfortable here in game number two, especially being down in the series. Train just going to big, you can make a big clear. Train looking for the shot blocked by Django. Sean going to follow this up. Getting contested by an orange player and stays neutral ground. Spider, though, getting up in time. Train tried to get there, but he couldn't. And that's going to be a tie game, and we're not even a minute in. A beautiful play. Spider just reading the ball off the wall. Train almost getting there, but ended up bashing it into their old goal post. And that went in instead. So we're all tied up here. Just about a minute in to game number two. Jibbo. Look at the pass. Ravella. There to intercept the clear. A lot of connection. A lot of problems with this connect at the moment. All three players were in the corner, but they were able to get a big clear. Sean winning two fifties in a row. Stub Spider getting the slightest touch you can ever think of. And putting the ball in here. Sean winning that over Chivo and Spider. Somehow getting up there, passing it through the player and getting it through the little crack between the player and the goal post. That's going to allow Disconnect to take a one goal lead here. 
not looking good for UTSA, but they still have time to recover. The Django, though, looking for the air dribble. Off the ground, went for the pinch. Couldn't get it, though. Train's going to try to put this in the corner, but Spider is there. Centered up, Chivo gets a small touch. The Django coming up to challenge, but he missed, and that's going to be a beautiful shot from Ravella tying this game up. Chivo getting a good touch, a double commit. Very dangerous, and a musty flick coming from Ravella to hit that ball a little bit higher and putting the ball in. That was really nice out of Ravella. Definitely the MVP right now for this game on UTSA. Sean, though, going to put this ball up high already. Train. Oh, missing that, but Chivo following that up. See some bullying happening in the net. A shot coming in, a good block from Train, but Spider opts to keep the pressure on. Ravella getting a big touch. Clearing this off into the other corner. Sean, though, couldn't get the pass. He's looking for a spider. Able to contest it in the middle. Train missing again. Train is going to have to work on some of his aerials off the wall. A pinch. Ravella not rotating back. Tried to take on Django. And that basically just hurt his teammate. Who I believe that was Chivo. Yeah, Chivo was there. He could have rotated in to possibly block that shot. So with that disconnect blue, he's going to take the lead here. Still about a little more than a little, little more than half time, I should say. So UTSA still have plenty of time. A lot of tackling going on at the moment. Ravella looking for the shot. The Django there tried to read that one as well, but a big clear over to the disconnect side. Spider getting a huge flick there. Looking to try to beat Train. No, Train connects with it. Sean looking for the shot. Chivo clears it, but it's in the middle. Django, soft touch. A double commit coming out of UTSA, but they were still able to get this over to the side. Django to the middle of the spider. Spider looking for the double touch. He couldn't get high enough, but Sean following that up, missing that completely. Train now has an open net, but he's taking his time instead of trying to even pass it. Chivo looking to be the bully, and he does. Train gets the goal in, and we're all tied up. But two minutes and 10 seconds of game two. Little dangerous there. Train decided to slow that down, but it ended up working in the end as Chivo decided to go ahead and go for the bump play. That was a very good team play out of the two of them. Sean now looking for the pass to center. Cleared out by Shivo. Shivo struggling a little bit to get a touch, but he steals the blue team's go uh, boost. Oh, that's dropping straight in and a big save. Actually, I think that was a own team save, but Train. Now Train is waking up and warming up. He gets that goal in and UTSA is going to take the lead here. A beautiful aerial by Train. Really watching where he was going there. Getting a nice touch and lobbying that right in to the net utsa now in the lead with one goal minute 50 seconds left spider looking for a good flick Ravella there to save it oh chivo missing that one sean and train 50 50 clear it out on to the disconnect side another 50 in favor of utsa sean missing that one to django forced to go up Ravella missing his shot so spider is going to now follow this one up He's going to slow this one down, getting it past Train. Uh, nicely done by there. Django up, looking to try to get a pinch off the ground, but could not get down in time. Sean hitting this to the backboard. Ravella there in the corner. Spider getting it past one, getting it past two. Train tries to clear this up. It's still dangerous. Django just missing the target off and hitting the bar. Ravella getting a big clear that's on target two. No one is back. And that's going to be a two goal lead for UTSA. It seems that Disconnect Blue is trying to play a little bit more aggressive than they can handle at the moment. And a big clear to a wide open net for UTSA. Easy for Ravello to put that one in. A minute left and Disconnect is down by two. But the kickoff favor to Django. Hitting the crossbar though. Sean, follow that up. Good block by Ravella. Chivo now looking to slow the game down. Every second waste is a second loss to Disconnect. Train. Just going to try to get this over to the disconnect side. Air dribbling that all the way over, but putting in the hands of Sean. Spider trying to control this, winning that 50-50. Ravello forced to come back. He's going to try to bring this over to the other corner. Django up to challenge him. Ravello doing a nice job, hitting that away. 30 seconds left here, and disconnect still looking for two goals. 
Ooh, Ravella looking for the fake, but missing the shot. And another miss right there. But it was 50 50. Sean, 50 50 straight to the other side, but Chivo receives it. The Django now. We're going to bring this up. Fakes out Ravella. 10 seconds left. It's on the backboard. Chivo up. Clears this one away. It's looking pretty clear that this game is going to go to UTSA. That's JV. And we are going to be moving on to a game number three. A great play out of both of these teams now. Seems that UTSA kind of fixed their mistakes. I saw a lot less double commits. And I say a lot less double commits. We're on the other side now. Disconnect Blue was starting to do some more discon... Uh, they were actually disconnected and doing a lot of double commits. So they have to be careful about that. It's going to see now if Disconnect Blue can actually fix their mistakes that they had in that last one and kind of go back to how they were playing in the first game where they were they were applying a lot of pressure and good pressure but it can't be too much where they can't handle it and get back in case there's a big clear that utsa was able to take advantage of most of the time if utsa has noticed that that is their kryptonite they should be able to take advantage of that Ooh, a big angle though sean looked for the sean train getting the save cleared out to the middle stop spider just trying to get in the way sean oh did not matter hitting the crossbar but very dangerous the django passing this out to spider off the backboard to jangles up gets it past chivo it's just off target though spider Ooh, to django <laughs> rotating right with the ball and it's one of the big rules of rocket league you do not rotate on the same side as the ball he ended up blocking his teammate and not allowing him to take a shot. That ball's pretty high. The Django looking for that angle, but it's too tight. But Sean already back. Starting to recognize the mistakes of having too many players up. Django clearing this off. Train stopping it at the half yard. Chippo trying to again to clear this one out. And Train was able to follow that. Ravella looking to put this on to the backboard without any boost. Ops to try to go for a doink pass instead of maybe a bully play or a bump play. Big clear to Spider, but off target. The Django and Spider have been looking for those plays and they've pretty much mastered it. And Sean able to figure it out and put the first goal in for Disconnect Blue. A good play by him. Just putting it off the backboard. Chivo not in the right place. Another player in the backboard. And their third not back. So that was a pretty easy shot for Sean to put in. And that's going to give Disconnect to Blue a one goal lead. And this is a single elimination bracket. So if either of these teams lose, they are officially eliminated in the first round and no one wants to be round, first rounded. These guys are going to definitely play a little sweaty. And whoever wins this is going to go against Satisfaction, which has the player Daru on the team on their team, which I believe has won four gauntlets, four or five. It's either he won four and going for his fifth, and Ravella is going to put the first one in. Either one, one four going for the fifth or one five going for the sixth. I can't remember off the top of my head. But a good play, Shivo passing that to Django. Could not get to the ball in time. And Ravella... Got to put that goal in. We are all tied up with about three minutes left here. Ooh, Django went for the shot, and Sean followed that one up. I'm sorry, I got a little distracted there. So let's see, right off the kickoff. Oh, from the corner, Django doing a good job following that one, and Chivo not being able to read that pass. Sean had an open net to put that in. A quick response at a disconnect blue. And they now have the lead in three minutes left in this game. Ravella now looking for the quick respawn off the corner. Train looking for the shot, but blocked by Spider. Ravella getting a little touch. They end up passing to his teammate. Big clear stub. A double commit again. Sean is ready back, dangerously going up. Able to 50 against Shivo, buying time for his team to rotate back. Spider up to Sean. Sean missing that one though. Ravella, that hide to Django is going to try to put this in the corner. Train is already there. He's going to look to pass this into the center. Ravella tried to get a pre-jump almost. Big clear from the Django. Stop already up. Clears it and tried to pinch it into the center. Not the best touch in the world. The Django going to get a touch, but ends up putting it in the hands of the UTSA players. The Django pass to Spider. 
Ravella reading it. Train looking to just find a bully play, but Sean able to get away from him and block the ball before it went in. The Django putting this into the corner. Train his last man back. It's a big clear. He's going to follow that one up. Spider able to get a touch, but gets bumped by Train. Sean now up. Looking to do the solo play. Off the backboard gets a demo as well. Train centering this out in the middle. It's pretty dangerous there. Spider. Bouncing off the backboard to Django. Taking, his, taking a little bit of time. Chippo up. Big clear. Spider already back. But not the touch he was looking for. This is dangerous. The Django able to get up in time and clear that. Spider now clearing this to the Django. The Django off the wall. Spider falling up that a little late. Train was able to get the touch, but got demoed. Ravella getting a little fancy with his aerials. Chippo able to get up in time. Spider is going to stop that one. Putting that in the center again. The Django getting a touch, but it's centered still. A lot of mistakes coming out of both teams. Confusion everywhere. And that is a goal that UTSA needed. You know that's going to hurt them. And that's going to haunt them for the rest of the night if they cannot get a goal to tie this one in. One minute left in the game. The Django almost putting that one in, but a good save from Ravella. Sean now double commit with the Django, but the pressure is still there for disconnect blue the Django touching it the wrong way though spider just trying to stop any momentum coming from the UTSA side Sean clearing this off into the corner again Chivo centers to train train looking for the shot it's going to be a waterfall looking to try to center again but spider is there at the moment oh getting bullied but spider able to react in time that's on shot but Sean able to clue that one away. Train is there. He's going to get over one, but with no boost, he can't follow it up. Chivo able to respond to that. It's in the corner. 20 seconds left here. Spider able to clear this one out. UTSA trying to figure out anything they can. Train still with no boost. He's not able to help his teammates out. Ravella is going to clear this one out. 10 seconds left. UTSA looking for anything that they can put into the net at this point. Centered up, but Chivo wasn't ready for it. One second left. The ball is up on the wall. Django is going to try to kill this one. Keeping it away from the other player. Shivo off train. The ball's still up. Ravella. What? Hitting the ball. Oh, it didn't go in. That was so close. Ravella almost putting that one in. But it didn't happen. And that's going to be it. Disconnect is going to take this and move on with the 2-1 series. You can see in the chat, they are definitely disappointed with that. Such a close shot coming out of, out of there. So with that, we are going to be ending this one here. Thank you very much for watching. That was the round one game of UTSA versus Disconnect. Disconnect is going to move on, and they are going to be playing against Satisfaction in round number two. Thank you for watching and make sure to check out the rest of the games here on RBG Esports YouTube channel. This will all be in a playlist. So with that, let's move on to the next video. Thanks for watching again.